As a matter of fact, we have another clip from okay. when, from when I played the character Sharon. Mm -hmm. So maybe check this out. And when we come back, let's talk a little about, you know, the challenges that filmmakers okay. have when, when they're putting production together. All right, everybody, check out this clip from when. That ain't got nothing to do with nothing. That child didn't die because we didn't sweep the floor. We have playgrounds and we don't even use them. What we need to do is stop looking for others to do and care for us and start taking care of ourselves. That, that, that kid didn't even get a chance to make his dream bigger than his environment. <sighs> We've been asking for the same thing for forever and a day. Jobs and justice. When are we going to start talking about the real problem? You know, as elders, we failed these kids. I enjoyed her, <laughs> you know, and I felt passionate about that right, right. character because I'm too. like, yeah, I was like, this really happens. Right. Like, that's one of them instances, like you said, you really have to put your mindset into mm -hmm. what's happening. Right. And you, because I was angry, like, like it was really happening. Right. When you walk away with that emotion from set, you know, you, you know, you, you hope that you did a good job. You know, uh, you know, so that's that's the key of being an actress or mm -hmm. actor. Mm -hmm. But let's talk about some of the challenges that you have, because a lot goes in Definitely. to film outside of just having money. Definitely. So what are some of the other things that you're challenged well, with? Well, some of the challenges are people don't understand how this can take you away from your family sometimes, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. whether it's a weekend, a day, a couple hours. Your relationship, right? Um, and that's not even getting to the financial side, right? You know what I mean? Because you still have to go home and be a husband, a wife, a girlfriend, a dad, whatever you know your title is. Mm -hmm. um, monetarily, it's hard to build a team at an independent level, right? Because everybody might not see the vision. People need to be paid for their time. You know what I mean? So everybody's not going to be as passionate about your project as you are. Mm -hmm. And that's a challenge for you to understand. Mm -hmm. That everybody's not going to put in the same blood, sweat, and tears you got. You might not be able to pay everybody what they're worth. Right. You know what I mean? They don't understand that Terrence Howard only got $12,000 for Hustle and Flow. Right. And it made millions. Right. They don't or, understand. Or Monique got 50000 for Precious. Exactly. <laughs> you know, you would Viola think. Davis, I believe she has $678 for her role in Antoine Fisher. What? But look what it did for her career. Right. Right. They don't see that they got it. There's a sweat equity that comes into it. Right. You know what I mean? So sometimes that's a challenge of trying to help others understand that we all have to put in our work. We all have steps we have to do. And if you're going to be on a project, you have to put in what you can. Right. There's challenges where actors feel they're not getting paid, so they're not going to promote a project. Mm. So if you're not going to promote yourself, who do you expect to promote you? Right. Right. I have to promote the project <laughs> myself right. because it's the project, and the project has you in it. Mm -hmm. But if you're not promoting yourself. You can't force somebody not to promote themselves. So well, that's very good point. that's very key. Yes. And um so people can stick to that. Like Monique didn't want to promote Precious because she wasn't paid to promote Precious overseas. Right. She wasn't paid to do a certain amount of press run. You know what I mean? So actors don't have to understand at this independent level, there's work you have to put in. I'm a producer director. I watch what other actors are doing mm -hmm. and how they do or don't share the projects they're in. Right. So either you're embarrassed of your work or you just don't share. Something Which one on. is it? So that might be a thing that keeps me away from you. Mm, right. You know, you I might mean, have to be very challenging for me to try to overlook some things. Right. Because I'm one of those I'll tolerate you until I can replace you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, so we have to understand the work. So those are some of the challenges of getting locations. Right. That's another thing. You know what I mean? Thing, so right. I have but so many aunts. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> and my aunts, they're going to keep letting me film in their living room, their right. hallway. My mother. Right. You know, my mother, she opens up her door for us to film. Right. You know what I mean? Part of that is help bridging the gap that we had for mm -hmm. all those years that were missing. Mm. But those can be challenges. Some right. locations want insurance. Right. Especially when you're bringing in equipment. You know? Yeah. And yeah. some people don't have the LSC, the Corporation C, Corporation S to do these things. Mm -hmm. So it limits you. Right. And it's hard to build a team. I'm a creator. I want to create. Right. Like Jay-Z, I may need that Dame Dash who's doing the business side. Yes, You know yes. what I mean? So I could just stay focused on writing, producing, filming, directing, whatever I got to do. Mm -hmm. So now I have to be the director, the writer, sometimes the cameraman. Right. Sometimes I have to mic people up with audio. Right. These are things that you have to do to make the project go successful. Mm -hmm. And if people seeing you go all in, you're hoping that they'll come in and go all in as well. Right. As actors. Right. Or DPs or sound, whatever, you know, you bring it on to the team, so... Those that, are some of the challenges. That is definitely a challenge. And that's also for most businesses. Like, right. you have to make sure your team has the same vision, share the same passion, 
the same love, so you can mm -hmm. hopefully get that same energy as right. if it was their own. You should you should walk into a project like it's your own, right. whether you, it's your name on it or not. You know, mm -hmm. you're still a part of it. You right. know, and it's important. Even with just give me the mic. When I first started, I had like 20 people. Right. Yeah, it was fun when we got the free tickets. You know, to go to concerts and shows. Mm -hmm. But then when it's time to settle down right. and do work, it was like you know I got to chase people down. So right. I was like, you know what? I'm also just do it all myself. You know. And people have to understand that sometimes as the lead person, CEO, director, whatever it is. You may be the last one to get paid. You are. And some people need Most to learn times to understand you that. Are, that's right. the challenge. Yeah. But if things are taken care of itself, the money will come. You know what I mean? The money yeah. will come. You know, people have to understand it. But it's all about what you're in it for. Right. And what it's about. Right. Yes, you need the money. I'd rather get the money and flip it into another project. Me keep too. flipping it, keep flipping Me it. Too. Instead Me too. of going say this, upgrade my equipment. Right. Go get new lenses, new cameras, new mics. Lights, everything that you need, you know. So that's that's the pretty much I tell. That's the real challenge. That's a real challenge. For all, you know. And even for me, like as an actress, like I know a, a lot of people that done more projects than mm -hmm. me and who have done less. And I see how people are like, oh well, I need to get paid at this point because this, that, and the third. I feel like I'm a good actress, and I okay. know that I can, you know, that I can. I'm proud of myself, right. you know, and I and I'm. A, proud of the work that I've done. Sometimes I might not even think that I've done a good job. People are like, oh, that was great. And I'm like, right, really? Right. You know what I'm saying? You just never know how it's going to hit somebody else. But I've never been driven mm -hmm. by money. I right, don't know right. if that's because I'm comfortable. I can't say. Well, you have to look at it as an investment into yourself. Right. You know what I mean? So Thank I'm you. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm getting to. Whether I'm spending gas to get here or spending my time, it's an investment in yourself. Because you may not have a physical visual reel, but you know what? You're building relationships. And I'm learning. Path, I'm and learning. Learn. Every character, you will learn yes, something, yes, right? Definitely. So I never look at that like, oh, well, you know, I, I, I don't know. I just never, I'm happy to have the opportunity. Right, you know right. what I mean? It goes into your core makeup. Right. Of who you are. Right. You know, what you're about, where you're trying to go mm -hmm. in your career. Mm -hmm. And meeting and learning people in the challenge. Right. Like when I first met you, I said, look, I'm going to challenge you. You did. That's the only way I got to <laughs> do did. it. You know what I mean? Because if you get on the screen and play yourself, there's no challenge. No. But there may be a movie where I need you to play yourself. Right. You know what I mean? But I want your family and friends to look at you say, that's Sharon, that's not Deborah. Right, right. And that's one of the main goals. And I thank you. And I appreciate thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I love the challenge because, you know, that's what I'm here for. I want to learn something mm -hmm. all the time, every day. You know, I just don't. But, you know, sometimes... You know, I'm just happy by nature. Like, right, right. I, I just love the experience and I appreciate things. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I may be a little happy. Right, right, right. <laughs> Too happy, but that's just my nature. Like, some sort of I'm just so excited mm -hmm. because I'm doing things that I love. You know what I well, mean? Well, you have to work on bottling. Right, right. Because no. your role may call for you to be mean and nasty and stubborn. You know what I mean? So when they say cut. That's what I said. You noted. Have to stay into that. I What's said noted, you know what I mean? right? So, right? But, but Figure see, the mood in the moment of the scene. But look, I, but look when I did um, Words Can't Explain. Mm -hmm. I felt like, like you said, I just, I don't know what it was. Okay. Maybe, I don't know what it was. <laughs> I was just like, let's go. Like, mm -hmm. uh, but it happens. Sometimes you're just in different places. Right, you know right, what I right. mean? But I know that I can do it because I've done it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So, but it's all about learning and growing. That's it. And again, I, like I said, I hope everyone that's watching this show definitely learns something today, walks away, gets yes. motivated gets inspired mm -hmm. in some type of way by something we said today. And um, follow and support. Follow and support. If you want to be an actress, reach out. See, you know, mm -hmm. see if they, if you can be a part of projects. That's the best way to do it. Never, yes. Even if you didn't act before, mm -hmm. you can reach out to a director or somebody who's worked that you like and say, look, do you need an extra? Right. You know, mm -hmm. can I be on set? That's a way to get involved if That's you don't right. know how to start. So true. So true. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So again, thank you for joining me. Thank you and for having me. Yes, our next guest is coming right up, everyone. Nate the Mime. Don't go nowhere. We'll be right back. The ability to have my show during this time is helpful because I can stay connected with my friends, still interview people, and share my um, content.